haven't done many videos this year and that's because I've had a bit of an accident. But I couldn't miss this one, we're outside um, the Holiday Inn Express in Mambas. This is one of the hotels that the government is flooding with um, illegal immigrants. They are not wanted here and this is a protest, but of course the, uh, the Antifa lot, the uh, Unite the Union has been funding, f funding busloads of lefties to come from all over the country. Um, opposite us, you can probably hear them. Um, but the people here have had enough. Um, we saw in Liverpool that the protest, there was a video circulating of one of the um, one of the uh, custodians, uh, one of the well, one of <laughs> one of the illegal immigrants in Liverpool Hotel. I shouldn't laugh, but it's laugh, but it's quite serious. But um, yes, uh, video circulated. There was a schoolgirl. She said repeatedly, I'm 15 years old, and she was getting sexually abused by some of the illegal refugees in Kirby, in Liverpool. Um, she was getting hounded. Um, no matter how many times she said she was 15, there was, there was um, illegal immigrants, 25, 27-year-old, maybe even older, um, harassing them. And um, the people of Liverpool turned up, and of course, the mainstream media We've heard it all say far right. These people aren't far right. They are just concerned parents. And they do not want them here. Look at the state of these brats. Look at them. <laughs> Jobs and homes, not to racism. Well, there's plenty of anti-white racism being portrayed by the mainstream media and even employers. There's a lot. Um, I'll be doing a video on that. There's a, there's a certain thing called dignity at work, which is clearly anti-white. And it's telling people, if you're white, you need to keep your mouth shut or you're going to lose your job. Yeah. And um, yeah, I'm sure these people don't protest about that. We need to get the photograph taken. I seem to be here early. I wondered where everybody was. Um, I thought, oh, it should have started at two, and it's about 20 past two now. Um, Antifa's getting a bit nasty behind me, but um, a police officer's just informed me that um, at 20 past two, that our designated protest area has been changed. It's now over on the main road, across a roundabout, nowhere near here, nowhere near the hotel. He's just asked if I want to move, and I said, well, no. I don't. I'm quite happy here to um, in the original pen, even though I'm here on my own. But there's uh, all these people, all these people in the car park. They're local people. These are people who haven't been bussed. Um, one of the far left nutters over there at microphone was just saying to everyone that um, we've had three buses come from Sheffield. So these people. All these unwashed uni students, they're from Sheffield. They probably live down south somewhere. You know, somewhere where there's no refugees, somewhere where there's no illegal immigrants, somewhere where there's no diversity whatsoever. Um, yeah, it's all government funded, this lot behind us. Clearly. And look at that silly flag there, Antifa. Well, no thank you. I'm staying put. Look at this. Look at this. I'm in frontline action here. Far left nutters. Police, uh, if that was our lot doing that, the police would be having batons out by now. They don't get the batons out on these people. Right, I'm at, I'm at the front of um, what was the original pen for our protest. The reason why I'm the only one here is because apparently 
I wondered why everyone was over at road, but with me being on wheels, I'm on a wheelchair at the minute because I'm not allowed to put any weight on my right leg. Um, I got the taxi to drop me off, expecting the protest to transfer over here. Police have informed me, they're now not letting them come here. They're, they're literally on the main road, nowhere near this hotel really, um, at the roundabouts. Um, so, yeah, as usual, the police are protecting these illegal immigrants, these uh, these boatloads of refugees that nobody wants here apart from the loony left who are funded by the government. <laughs> Testing. And now we're oh, not letting them get over here. Yeah. Police give us this area to protest in. And now they're, they're, now they're not letting the majority to come in this area. Unbelievable. You're in the house, man. I can see it in your eyes, How many people are you on? Fucking ones! How many more pedos do we need? 
Fucking help the police! We've got enough fucking rabies! The police have got more rabies than that! I'm dead! We're all here for one thing! Save the bomb! Save the bomb! Save the bomb! Oh, 
So the far left nut jobs over there started pulling fences down and creating havoc. And the uh, police, of course, have not moved them back, they've moved us back. They've split the protest up in two different locations, so it doesn't look like there's as many of us as, as, there, is them, as there is them. And now they're moving us back when they cause the trouble. Unbelievable.